This story out of LA is crazy. This is Feezy LeBron, a rapper based in Los Angeles. Feezy was approached by an officer at a traffic stop in LA County on New Year's Eve. What happened next is hard to watch. Body cam shows the officer threatening Feezy if he failed to comply with his orders. You take off in this car, I'm gonna shoot you. I'm gonna make it super easy on you. You put this car in drive, you're getting one white to the chest. Feezy is detained in his car despite asking repeatedly. Sorry about the arrest or what, bro? You, got guns you, are, you are most definitely 1,050% detained. What? It's already been explained to you. Feezy is then asked to exit his vehicle, but he insists he did nothing wrong. If you don't listen, you're done. You understand me? The footage was just released on Friday and people are outraged. Ultimately, Feezy was only cited for a missing license plate. The video went viral and now the LA County police say the incident is under investigation. Cops are extremely worried about this TikTok trend and now they're starting to crack down. Back in October, we told you about six teenagers who were killed in a car accident, one of them a newly pregnant mother. But this wasn't just a case of reckless driving, the teenagers were driving a stolen Kia as part of the Kia challenge. For the last several months, police departments across the country have reported dozens of instances of stolen Kias and Hyundais as a result of this challenge. Teens aged 14 to 17 have stolen these cars and gotten into dangerous, sometimes deadly accidents. Cops say these cars can easily be broken into due to a security flaw, and before we go any further, please do not under any circumstances try to do this. To fight this deadly trend, New York police are suggesting this low-tech solution, a steering wheel lock. As of now, Kia and Hyundai don't have any plan to recall their vehicles, but Hyundai has released a security kit that costs $170. They've also partnered with police departments in certain areas. Well, it looked like these kids is back on this rise of stealing Kias and stuff for you. And it's kind of sad to see and hear that your hard working dollars. can't just sit outside in your yard looking nice or you can't go somewhere and not have to worry about being violated by somebody who want to steal your car something you worked hard for now I don't understand why a lot of people buy Kias and they're not trying to do anything about this theft service now you know I think well I don't know because even with the Mopars did they do anything about the Mopars? I'm saying the kid ain't do nothing because what we hearing from John. You know what I'm saying? So, I know the Mopars, they be selling Mopars a lot. But, did they solve the issue with them stealing Mopars? Because they still, the Mopar cars, you know what I'm saying? They still out here. But you don't hear them as bad as kids. First of all, I'm first of all, I'm nothing. I'm, I'm, I'm stupid, disrespectful bitch. Go. Go! Please! I got one. Oh, if anybody wants to know, she was at her, her, her ex-girlfriend. Two of her ex-girlfriends. No! Ex -girlfriends. Don't ignore me! Never and, and, and they never shut talked to me! Shut the fuck up, bitch! And ignored me while she was there. Is she in the wrong? She's she in, in the wrong. wrong. You, you ain't in the wrong. wrong. Get out of my fucking face! Oh. She, you stupid, disrespectful She got bitch. every right fuck. to be mad. I got every goddamn right to be mad. Bitch, even your fucking now that gotta be very heartbreaking to find out she was not only at one of the axes but at two of the axes you know what i'm saying and she up here and she looked mighty good i could say she, she looked good to me 
You know, that bread, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, let's get back into what we was talking about. She got caught cheating, you know. She was at two exes' houses, ain't no telling what they was doing. She didn't want to call the scene, but that night she caught her on the right day. And she said, yeah, you caught me on the right day. Now, I'm chilling with my homegirls, and you tried to. Y'all see how she growing up on her like this? See, that's a a domestic abusive relationship. And it's a good thing she had the support she did because this is why she probably stood up for herself and said, no, enough is enough. Here's what else we're watching. The six-year-old who shot his teacher probably won't be charged, but it could be a different story for his mother, the owner of the gun. Cops will have to look at the whole picture, including whether it was properly secured. Virginia has a law that protects kids 14 and younger from access to firearms, so the kid's parents could be on the hook. 